There are some new charges in the shooting of Detroit police officer Lauren Quartz, and we're hearing from his partner about her heroic, heroic actions the night he died. This is the first time Officer Amanda Hudgens is sharing her story from that horrible night when police were facing a barrage of gunfire. Hudgens spoke to our Kimberly Gill, who joins us live from the newsroom. And Kim, uh, what's she saying about all this, and how's she doing? She's taking it day by day. Pam, good afternoon to you. And, and you know, we all heard Chief James White praise Officer Amanda Hudgens for her bravery and heroism. She had her back to the gunman as she tried to save her partner, Officer Lauren Quartz's life. She's originally from Washington State and told me when she moved here to become a Detroit police officer, Officer Quartz was her first friend. They went through their training at the Detroit Police Academy together. They had worked as squad partners for the past three years. She said her children even called Quartz Uncle Lolo. Here's more on how she describes Officer Quartz and their relationship. You worked with him every day. Yes, every day. Oh, wow. 16 hour days, you know, we worked doubles together. We did everything together. Incredible. What kind of person was he? Amazing. Um, he had a laugh that could light up the room. Um, you know, we're human. I could be having a bad day. He would know I'm having a bad day through our text messages or our conversations. And he would show up with an energy drink and some kind of candy that I loved. And just to make my day a little better, he was my best friend. I don't think I've never connected with somebody in such a soulful way that, I mean, it's, it's more than you can even describe. Just heartbreaking, you know. And another thing she said to me that she called him and text messaged him so much that instinctively she just reached for her phone to tell Officer Quartz about her interview with us today. 